16th person voted out of Australian Survivor, Brains vs. Brawn, and third member of our jury, Laura. Oh. <laughs> you need to bring me a torch. Oh. <laughs> Laura, the tribe has spoken. <laughs> Thanks. See you. Thanks, guys. See ya. <laughs> I have just been eliminated from the game of Survivor. I cannot believe that Kara didn't go home again tonight. I did feel this afternoon that we needed a contingency plan just in case something came up. We didn't do it, and hey, look, I'm now going home, but she lives to see another day. <laughs> Oh, I look, look at this hair. I'm actually looking forward to a shower. I'm surprised I'm not, not covered in more dirt. Woo. I have been blindsided in an epic play from Survivor. It was great. It was an unknown hidden immunity idol and all the votes on Kara didn't count tonight. One single vote for me. It's quite comforting to know that it was only one vote. Uh, and getting knocked out in an epic blindside like that is actually the way I wanted to go. I didn't want to sit there knowing that people were voting me out. I just wanted to have a nice clean cut. In a, a little way, I felt Tribal would be pretty straightforward. I think Kara thought Tribal was pretty straightforward with her going home as well. But we should all know that travel is never straightforward because travel has never been straightforward. I'm so excited to go and have a shower, have a glass of wine, scrub off 35 days worth of dirt that is embedded into my legs and wash this mop of a hair. Uh, I'm pretty excited about that. I'm really looking forward to seeing Baden and Gerald and seeing how they thought this game has played out, especially tonight at Tribal. I'm really interested to see to hear their thoughts and um, yeah, just have a chill outside of the game with them. Hello, Laura. Where am I going? We're waiting. <laughs> Hello. Welcome. <laughs> oh, hi. Wait, <Wait, Liz. laughs> <laughs> oh, Shit, there's so you're, much you're, food you're, you're here. At the head. You're at the head of the table. Oh, man. How crazy was that? <laughs> yeah. oh, who, who even had the idol? I think it was Way. Really? Yeah, so, um, and it, that was such a weird, oh my God, oh my God, yes. I'm so excited about this. Because I thought maybe, maybe, just maybe it might have been Kara herself. Because otherwise, whoever um, played it still voted for Kara. Still voted for Kara. Because every vote was for Kara, bar one. Bar one, which, which is was hers. So she's still oh, stuck to the plan. I think it was Wei. From, from her hugging me saying, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. <laughs> she was sitting with a hand in her hand. Wei. Mm. It was Wei. It was totally Wei. As soon as it happened, she was there with her hands in her Yeah. Hand. So obviously no one realised that there was that immunity idol at all. No. But that immunity idol was wild. That you could play it and you didn't have to say who, no one had to know who it was. Exactly. Right? I just want to know where she got it. Yeah. I'm so curious about that. Mm. How good is food, though? Oh, there's your milk intake going. Uh, I think this bottle of Monte will be 10 litres. Oh, God. <laughs> Gerald. It just feels weird, like, being like, oh, I'm not going to wake up there tomorrow. Oh, yeah. Yep. I thought I was going back for rice. Oh, oh, it smells good in here. <laughs> oh, shampoo. Body wash. Oh my god, a toothbrush. I cannot wait to use this. Is it sad I want to go back to the dirt? <laughs> <laughs> but this feels pretty good. I am missing everyone. They've become my little family. It's good though. I like it. I'm happy to be here. The smell is what is getting me the most. It actually smells clean. And I don't. No, I don't. 
toothbrush, shampoo, conditioner. Oh my God, body wash. Oh, what a treat. Chickens, fresh eggs. I haven't had eggs in a month. I love this farm. There's horses and everything here. It's great. An axe for Gerald to show me some tricks on how to wood chop. Uh, but, oh man, this is actually the perfect gift for Ben. A shitty bike. <laughs> He's gonna love this. Tour de France, eat your heart out. All right, guys, I've got a surprise for you, but you have to be blindfolded. Oh. And I'll come back. All right, I've taken my survivor skills from Tribe to forage around the farm today to find you guys presents to ease the burden of being voted out. <laughs> and Baden, I found you. You can have a look. It's a witchy love, isn't it? <laughs> it's not, I found you the world's shittest bike. Oh. Just... Oh, God. <laughs> ah, it's cool. Yeah. I mean, come in handy. Yeah. I, I don't know how you're going to ride it, but good luck. <laughs> That's a proper speed racer, that one. <laughs> <laughs> he looks like he should be in the sound of music. <laughs> He's going straight to the pub. <laughs> <laughs> He's going to the right tree. He's absolutely He's going, going to the right tree. Yep. <laughs> so good. <laughs> now, Gerald, I did actually vote you out. Oh, I know. <laughs> I have you this present. <laughs> and I know you're not going to be um, too impressed because you didn't make it. And I know you're going to tell me that it is probably the world's worst <laughs> axe. But here you go. It couldn't be any worse than the hatchets we had at camp. <laughs> I'll be able to smash something with it. It really does feel a bit crap when your name comes out of the urn. You kind of think, what have I done? Who doesn't like me? Why do you want me to go? But at the end of the day, I kind of take it as a positive. Either people see you as a threat to their gameplay and they don't want you around, or it's just your time is up. People are super manipulative. They chop and change, they lie and they cheat. They form alliances that are true, they form alliances that are fake just to get ahead. And learning how to be on top of that and stay ahead of the game is really, really difficult. It's up to anyone now. I don't think I can predict it, but the people with the biggest gameplay, definitely George. He has absolutely killed it with his little mastermind of survivor tricks. And Wei, she's a silent assassin. She has inspired a lot of us with her tenacity and her ability just to keep strong. I'm pretty sure she's the one that got me booted. Hungry, <laughs> Laura? I'm sorry. I'm always hungry. Actually, it tastes really good. It's been so long since I've eaten this day. <laughs> Onion? Yeah, go for it. Double lean. Thanks. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we can cut the steak with the axe. Yeah, I'll split it. <laughs> well, can I'll you actually it. please do that? <laughs> <laughs> Drew <Drupal> is awesome. <laughs> Drew has got food. <laughs> <laughs>